All right, so we are here for the brand opening of uh, the Beverly Hills version yeah. for Oliver. So tell me how excited you are to be here tonight. I'm so excited. He has a bigger place and, the, the you know, very prominent in Beverly Hills. Nice location. I'm just happy for him and all the success he has reaped. Now, he had a store in Melrose, but he moved here to Beverly Hills, and Beverly Hills is very, very nice. I mean, how cool is it to, you know, know he has a store here in one of the, the nicest real estates in the world, I think. I'm happy for any Oliver for, or any Filipino that's owning a prime space here in Beverly Hills, for example. So that means we're moving up, so I'm, I'm very proud of that. Yes, and uh, we actually are wearing Oliver tonight, right? Yes, it's uh, one of Lay's uh, creations of Oliver, and it's very nice. I'm my favorite, very dainty, very feminine, perfect for red carpets or openings like this. <laughs> yes, and, uh, actually, um, tell me a little bit about kind of like the vibe and the feel. I know he has a lot of people here tonight. Like, how exciting is it to be part of that? Um, because uh, Oliver has always championed, you know, the Filipino talent, especially the promotion of Philippine textiles. So I'm very proud of him. And for him to be like preaching that or promoting that among the Hollywood actresses, that's a really big step for us, you know, especially, you know, you've seen her, his, his dresses, and they're worn by these actresses, and they are made of Filipino um, fabrics. Yeah. And these are, made, uh, these are, some of them are being, being done by from centuries old traditions in the Philippines. So it's really nice, like, you know, Husi and Pina and all that. Yeah. yeah. He, he has wedding dresses up there made out of that fabric. So I know you have daughters, maybe when they get married. Or I can get married again to Ruben, <laughs> another 30 years. <laughs> very nice. It's very nice. And one thing that's kind of changed, maybe this is a little bit more for Ruben. One thing that's changed is he's put out some men's clothes. We have it behind us. How nice are the colors and the fabrics? Have you got to look at the men's clothing yet? I like his choice, especially the barongs that you can actually wear them to Hollywood red carpet events. And also, I like that he has tuxedos that are not the conventional ones, and not the usual black ones, but I like what over there, they're like black and white textured ones that, you know, I, I break from the usual stuff. Do you think he'd look handsome in it? Who, Ruben? Ruben? <laughs> of course. He always looks handsome, but with Oliver Tolentino, it helps. Yeah. <laughs> he becomes handsomer. Yeah, and tell us, uh, you brought some guests, some very special guests here tonight that are yeah. nominated at the event. Tell us about that. Ah, Ronnie Del Carmen of uh, Inside Out, the co-director, and I'm so happy for him that he's here and his uh, successes in the, in the film. Congratulations to Ronnie. Yes. We're proud of him. And Ronnie said that he's not a good dresser, so we're trying to get maybe Oliver to give him something, yeah. but he's going to have to walk the globe. And also uh, Teresa, his wife, you yeah. know. So there will be, I'm sure, a lot of callers there and uh, very nice stuff yeah. <laughs> and hopefully it will lead down to the oscar red carpet too yeah. you know yeah. for them yeah, That'd be yeah. Incredible. And yeah. just one of many films hopefully has more and more in the future that are nominated yeah. yes we're mm -hmm. looking forward to inside out on the golden globes <laughs> yes absolutely so have you made a decision if you're gonna wear what you're gonna wear yet or you're still kind of deciding i i have but it's a, it's a secret you're gonna yeah. see it on the red carpet yes. <laughs> um, what how kind of tell me when you first met oliver and how you guys knew that you guys were going to become friends yeah the first time we interviewed oliver there was a the certain chemistry or vibe that this guy is sincere, he's honest, he wants to succeed and he's a very hard worker and that really clicked on me that I, I said oh I want, you know I want to help this guy and expose him also to other stuff here in Hollywood. Yeah. It's, it's great that you actually asked that because I was just thinking about that today how we met and it's actually through a film lawyer, attorney Nettles and his, his people and they introduced us they said i didn't even we didn't know who oliver was but they said this guy is opening a shop on melrose would you like to come and cover it and so i was just actually thinking of that so that's a good question yeah and, uh, i mean are you surprised and just uh, proud of how far he's come i mean i remember we were backstage at american idol and carrie underwood one of the biggest names on the planet was wearing his stuff so are you excited to see kind of his growth and how big he's become yeah, because she, as they say, talent will out. So no matter what, talent will out. And of course, I think Oliver is also very fortunate to have Andrew, his business uh, partner, to be with him, to guide him. And also, of course, his uh, devotion to promote Filipino textiles, Filipino talent. So that's really nice it's because he's helping uh, a lot of workers back home doing this in centuries old uh, tradition with the weaving of the, you know, the Filipino fabrics like Pina and Husi. Uh, this is actually uh, Oliver too. The, oh, wow, the purse is also, and some of the stuff he has asked from Bataan to be done in Bataan. And uh, one thing with Oliver is very reliable. If he says he's doing a gun on this Thursday, he has it on Thursday. It's never late, and it's very dependable. And he has a store in the in the Philippines too, so that's yeah. cool to see him to be able to kind of like have both sides, both representations. 
Yes, and I love it that he has a store in the Philippines, store here, and probably who uh, next time in you know other country, <laughs> another country. Well, I know you have a glass. Can you guys? What would you like to say directly to Oliver, and what toast would you like to give him tonight? Well, congratulations, Oliver. We're so proud of you that you're now move, opening a shop in Beverly Hills. So uh, I know that you'll continue progressing, and I know there will be greater things uh, for you. From Bataan to Beverly Hills, I cheers to Oliver Tolentino and more power. Absolutely.